Welcome to my Learning to Fly vlog. My name is Ben Atkinson and you can subscribe and follow the whole process of me hopefully gaining an NPPL right here on my channel. And there's more information at kemmelflyingclub.com and many thanks again to my amazing instructor who has over 9,000 hours experience teaching people to fly microlights. So this is episode six, the first real look at how to properly deal with an engine failure in this, the Sky Ranger Swift 2. It's a really important part of training, even though the commonly used Rotax 912 engine is really reliable. There's a real process to go through though, and this is the first part. You'll see a few attempts of landing with an engine failure. Please bear in mind, not everything is covered in this episode from this exercise, so look out for future episodes on engine failure training. Let me know with a comment below if it's a useful video to you, but please remember these videos are in no way a replacement for getting professional training and as ever all the checks are made before and during the flight if we had an engine failure now or an engine problem yep. uh, airfields well there's one almost under the nose which is chaven in strip the only problem with that today is the wind would be crosswind and it's a fairly shorter strip okay let's have a little look at chavenage so let's turn to the right so look out right yep. turn around that's it. So if we just turn to the right about 35, 40 degrees. Yep. Roll out. I can show you Chavenage airstrip. Okay. I hope. Which is just hiding the sun under that. It's just down here. So there's yep. a, it's a grass strip with a I've got it. Yeah, I see it. We're about halfway along it. Yeah. Three quarters way along. Yep. So it's a nice strip. Yep. Not, not, you know, not a mile long. It's probably about the same as our grass strip. Yep. About 500 metres or something. Yep. Uh, we could get it in there with the crosswind. The advantage of going in there is we know it's a known surface. Yep. And as long as we judged it right, we'd, uh, we'd be all right with the crosswind there today. Okay. What's the problem with if we had an engine failure heading off downwind at the moment. Do you remember one of our procedures was, yep. oh, go downwind, and then yep. turn into, what's the problem with that at the moment? Well, it's pushing us over uh, quite a built-up area. Built-up areas of yeah. valley, a valley, trees, yeah, yeah. woodland. Not a great place. Up there. Minch and Hampton Common is not very good, really. It's really no. uneven. It no. might, bits of it might look flat from up here, but it's quite no. a rough ground. Yep. Okay, so that's not good at all. So that's no. not going to work. What about turning into it to the left? Uh, looks a lot better. <laughs> it does look a lot better, doesn't it? From what it is. Alright, so okay. let's turn it to it to the left then. Okay. Just looking over my shoulder, everything's clear. Bit more left right up. I'm sort of maintaining a slight climb, but... Right. Okay. So, yep. the issue... Okay, just straight up there for a moment, that's great. So, the, the issue with... with descending into it that it's rather more difficult to judge a glide angle okay okay than it is off from the constant aspect turn yep so uh, okay um, again the area out to the right is not particularly brilliant particularly mm, with no. this southerly wind we've got undulating <laughs> ground a yep. bit of woodland so <coughs> are there any good fields down to our left now this one looks good uh, it's sort of wide at the base, although there are trees at the end of it, which is a question mark. Yeah, there's some also wires. Can you see the wires? Yes, I can actually. Yeah, I can. Well. Yep. All right. Yeah, there's wires. There's a bit further over. There's a nice long field straight into wind. Yep. I've got a couple of trees on the left side of it. Yes. One, two, three trees. Yep. And then back over, further back to the left there. There's yep. Some Fields that look a bit like more better pasture ground, actually. Yeah, yeah. More pasture ground, and yep. again, they're pretty much into wind. Yes. So, uh, so they might be quite useful. Yep. And then over to the right here, what have we got to the right into wind? Well, and there's that there's one by the road. Yeah, there's that one, and there's the one next to it down here. Yeah. They're both good fields. The yep. only slight issue with this one. Right underneath us. You just bank it up a bit. Yeah. Have a look just to the right until it's all clear. So this one right underneath us, it slopes downwards yep. at the bottom end. Yep. All right. That's oh, right. Yeah. Okay. Carry straight on. So anyway, that's a good. That's a good field. Okay. Yep. All right. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's fascinating. You could. I mean, there's so many fields, actually. But when you start looking harder, you quite quickly pick out the ones that are no good. 
Yes, and then the idea as we as we fly along, if we're flying on a, on a cross country, is yeah. that keep a lookout, you, you just keep an eye on. And particularly, we, we look for area first of all. So away to the left to get at the moment. You've got Not a temporary, yeah. and smaller fields around the town. If we look to the right, we've got open ground, much more open space. Yep. Um, and uh, in fact, there's the airfield at Bold Out Farm down there. Look. Yeah. See that? Uh, oh yes, I can. Yeah. So the only issue there is, do you think we would get to there from here at the moment? Uh, I'd s gosh, at 3,000 feet, I'd hope so. Yeah, I think I probably would. Where's, well, the wind, where's the wind from? Well, it's a crosswind. That's the only issue. Well, our wind's from the south. Yeah. That runway's about 220, That's I think. push us to the north, well, isn't it? I think it might be tight. Yeah. 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 from this height. So, uh, yeah, yeah. down there is about, what, it's less than 40 degrees, isn't it? 30? Yeah. 30 degrees? Yeah. 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 I think it might be pushed. Got some fields over here. Yep. Not really the quite the right direction. Nope. We have got our big fields down here, though. Do you see the one under the right tip? Yeah. The trailing edge? Yeah. That's a decent field, and we wouldn't press the 500 foot rule. The slightly lighter green yeah. one. All right, so let's have an engine failure now, then. Okay. So shut the power off, and let's turn downwind. So good look out. That's it. And we're going to we're gonna turn downwind. And we're immediately looking for our fields now. As it happens, we pre-selected this one, yep. so we can roll out. There's our field. Yep, so just the one with the triangle of trees next to it. No, it's the one next one over. Yep, okay. This one will be break that we break the 500 foot rule by the okay. road. Yes. So we're nicely downwind for it. Let's go to Best Glide to give us a bit of uh, a bit of a height, a bit of uh, and a bit of time really. So we're nicely downwind to it. So it was fun, T trim. Yep, sort trim. Out. Just sorting that now. Wind there's uh, wind turbine down here, which is yep. confirming the wind yep. uh, direction. Uh, all clear. So that's our surrounds. Yep. The wires at this end. Yes. Size, slope, and surface. Well, in yes. fact, it's slightly uphill until the very end. Yep. Surface looks good. Size, slope, surface, and then surrounds, as we just said. Yep. Fuel. Yep. So, yeah, we've sufficient. got fuel, yeah, we have. the engine temperatures look alright, yep. so we could try a restart. Yep. Pretend to press the button there. Press the button. Uh, it's a bit awkward on this aircraft, but you can pretend to pull the choke yep. out and press the button. Yep. Okay, well look at our speed now, so we need to start our turn. Yeah. Quick, start your turn, and look at the middle of the field as your aiming point. So that wind is strong, yes. so we need to keep that turn going. So it just shows you how you can get distracted with an engine start God, yeah. process yeah, yeah, yeah. and then miss your field. So you're doing the right thing, best glide, yep. 66, and cut back to the field. All right, now you could look at those angles. Yep. Still looking at the middle of the field. Don't yep. be tempted to look at the hedge. Feel that sinking air in the wind gradient. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Security check. Okay. Absolutely fine, yeah. Undercarriage down, brakes off. Mayday, mayday, mayday. Da -da -da -da. Right, we've got lots of height now. So let's have first stage of flat. Good. That's lovely. Next stage of flat, because we were in the field, or full flat. A little bit of a side slip, maybe, or forward slip. Yeah. So left, right, or right stick. We'll do, there we go. Throttle off, ignition off. Yep. Down there. Okay, back into balance. Round out, let it settle. Right, right, or left stick. Well done, and I have control. You have control. Very good. So, airspeed's good, climbing nicely. That was well done. Thank you. Would you like to take the full flap off for me? Yes, full flap off. Okay. And do you want me to change the trim slightly? Yeah, you can. There you go. Okay, well, uh, okay, the excitement's oh. over, so if you'd like to take control. I have control. And you need to get the second, the first stage of flap off now. It's off. Well done, no dramas. No okay. dramas. Uh, so, the next field we're going to go to, I like to move from field to field. Yep. It gives you a different perspective. Of course. But these are fields that we've checked out, and um, if the engine did stop, we could actually land in them. Cool. Right, we're going to go over to uh, uh, this area, over to our right. Yep. And 
and this time we're going to uh, run through another procedure but what we're going to do uh, when we're down to approximately a thousand feet above ground level is we're going to try and divert to the field next to the original choice okay so we're just going to be maneuvering the aeroplane we want to do that at a sensible height we don't want to be doing it at the last second of dodging trees and Cotswold stone walls, we want to do it at a sensible height. Yeah, right. okay. So I had to stay on this heading for a moment, we'll get into a decent position. Right, so under the wing, there is a field with some buildings just at the top end, just down here. Yes. You see those buildings? Yes. So behind those buildings, there are one, two, three fields in a row, one, two, oh, yep. well, four even. Yep. Yeah. So what we're going to do, if you level out now, so we're going to do a fan stop to the right-hand field. Yeah. Okay. And then we're going to we're actually going to look at the situation, and I'm going to ask you where you think might be might be better to land as we go through. So. Okay. Let's have a good look out around. Can't see any traffic. Okay. Okay. Below. So let's ease the power off, and let's head off downwind. So we're heading off downwind. Pause fun. T trim. So trim. Best glide come up. is what speed? 66. So I'm just going to find that. Found your field? Yep. So you can roll out. Okay. That's good. You're quite quite high to it. Yep. That's right. Just down here. So yep. create a little bit more space by going to the left. Okay. So if you look at that angle down there, it's about yeah. 45, 50 degrees, yeah. isn't it? Is it the one with the buildings on the end? No, the one next on the right next okay. to it. Yeah. Yep. So create a bit more space. Wind is almost on that field, yep. as we can tell. Yep. Uh, we're all clear, so that's surround, size, slope and surface. Yes. Is there a slope on it? Uh, it doesn't look like there is, to be honest. Possibly uphill. It slopes slightly. uphill at the slightly. beginning, doesn't it? Yes. Okay, surface doesn't look too bad at the moment. Nope. No, it looks good. Okay, fuel, so... Yeah, but good, we could start a restart. Try a restart. Try a restart. That's failed. Undercarriage down, brakes yep. are off. Yep. Okay, N is for... Uh, it's going to be note, notify, so we're going to go Mayday, 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 Sky Ranger. Yep. Start your turn now. Yep. So it's very important you start your turn early on this one because of the dr bit of drift we were experiencing. We lost sight of the airfield, didn't we? Yes, we did. So, right, so that's it. So you turn back now. There's your field. We seem to have plenty of height, but we know it's a strong wind. So it's just start to come back to the field a little bit. Okay. So this left-hand one of the three. So left -hand, that's it. So Amy points to the middle. Yep. So now, as we come down, you realise what's wrong with that field. It's a big slope up. It's quite a up slope, yep. and, and it's a crop. Yep. So I want you to stay at best glide, critically. Yep. And we, where, which is your best divert field? To the right. Uh, is it? To the... no, beyond. Well, that's your best field here. Oh, okay. Look at the surface. Yeah, 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 surface. yeah. Right, okay. It will be crosswind, but we've got lots of length. Yep. All right, are we high for it? We are. So let's have... One flat. stage of flat. Good. All right. Are we still high? Bit across. We're definitely in, aren't we? Yep. So you can go for full flat now. Okay. Good. Now you've got to turn down the left side of the field, and then you're going to come at a little bit of an angle to the right. Okay. Throttle off, ignition off. Throttle off, ignition off. Fuel off. We haven't got time for security. We'll take it right the way down. Now turn in towards the wall. Turn towards the wall, turn up the hill towards the wall. Yep. Now that's it, and I have control. You have control. Okay. Well done. So what you're trying to do is reduce that crosswind. The crosswind element. Yep. All right. So I'm looking, I'm highly aware at the moment, looking for my alternative fields. 500 foot rules, the building's away to the left. Yep. So if I come around here now. I'll take full flap off. Yeah, if you could do that, that would be great. We've got a good field, emergency field ahead. Yep. That's fine. Okay, you can take control now. I have control. You have control. Oh, flats away. And flaps all Yeah. All right. Yeah, good. I think the only slight thing that, well, I think I got slightly disorientated as to where the wind was coming from then. 
uh, which led me to sort of think we want to come in that way, if anything, rather than that way. But you were correct, except that those other fields were all crop yeah. of some sort, whereas the field on the left had loads of space, loads yep. of length, yep. uh, and it was a nice pasture field. Yeah. But we needed to try and reduce that crosswind element a little bit. Oh, right, right, right. Yeah. Okay, good. So we quite genuinely then, as we came into that field, which we were high for anyway, yep. we could see that it was crop. It, it had some form of crop in it. Mm, yeah. It was not a brilliant surface. No. That's just to make you aware of the possibilities of, of moving somewhere else. So. Yep. Okay. Are there any fields over to the left now? Yeah, there are. The first one I've picked out is the one beyond, it's sort of an L shape, beyond, just under the wing now. Yep. Which looks good. Alright. Possibly some ca yeah, some cables, just some low telephone wires this side of it. Alright. Which would be a question mark for me. Uh, below us now is quite a good feel, but actually it's sloping I think as well. Okay, well let's, um, let's have a, a, an engine power loss now, so you, you can do it smoothly, that's fine. Mm. Take it right away off there. Yeah. And you manoeuvre for your field, away you go. Alright, okay. There's trim, right, wind, so we know it's coming from the south, which is over there, uh, or actually over there, sorry. I'm gonna so downwind, we're going to keep it in sight, I'm going to do this, so wind, uh, A, all clear, yes, cross controlling slightly there. Nice and relaxed on the stick. Check that trim's good. Yep. Okay. Uh, How high above the ground do you think we might be now? Oh yeah. A <laughs> um, thousand feet maybe? Yeah, okay, that's good. Yeah, well done. So actually, my field is now under there, so I've just lost sight of it under the cowling, and there's a built-up area there. So, if I was going to change my field, it would be the one with the digger in probably, because it looks very long and it's going to be into wind potentially. Oh, we could even... We could actually take, take, going that take, one, yeah. take the airstrip. You want to take, try and oh, take yeah. the airstrip? Where's the airstrip? <laughs> there it is. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll yeah, be yeah. crosswind. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. right, okay. See, that's how... <laughs> what, all we could let you All right. clear surround, size, slope, service is good. Looking yep. for any other traffic. Yes. So, uh, so back to checks. Secured... Uh, I think we're probably... We're too low to do an engine restart now, so yep. that's it. Right. Watch your speed, watch yep, your speed in the turn. That's it. Yep. Well done. Okay, so let's go one, one stage of flap. Right. I'd probably stick with one stage of flap on this runway. Because yep. you've got a good surface, yep. but a, a significant crosswind. Yep. So we'll go down, it's all clear around, it's fine. That's it. Take it right away in as if it was a real landing, that's okay. There we go. Well done. And we'll go around, so I'll okay. have control. You have control. Okay. Well. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna turn into the wind straight away before I get to those woods. Yep. So I've got space ahead of me if we had a problem. Yep. You could take the flap off for me now. That's all. Good, good. I'll trim that for you slightly. Yeah, I'm sorry. Well done, I'm taking all the flap off. Yep. Yeah, we only had one stage. Yeah. Oh. Alright, so you got in a okay, you have control now, I'll find control. Way. So we just we did get in a little bit of a muddle there, didn't we? Yeah, we, we did. Actually, you actually crossed back over your field. Yeah, yeah. Uh, which will cause problems. Right. Yeah, that's that's interesting. I, and I didn't actually notice the airfield. <laughs> well, no, no, that's all right. Uh, so there's the first look at engine failure training. A lot happens fairly quickly, so I really need to learn the procedures until they're second nature. We had briefed to try and approach emergency fields left downwind, so I as the pilot had the best view possible of the field, but circumstances seemed to work against us that day for that. The Sky Ranger, though, of course, has really great visibility, and that's something else to bear in mind, which we will cover in another episode, as this is something that will be developed more over time and 
I need to practice again and again. Don't forget to subscribe, click the thumbs up as well, and I'll catch you next time for a very special episode, which will be my first solo flight.